Hello, I am Neeraj Gupta. I work at IUCA as a faculty and I look at our universe and galaxies in it at radio wavelengths. These are essentially the wavelengths or frequencies at which our mobile phone, microwave ovens at our home operates. So I look at how galaxies in our universe are evolving at these wavelengths. Now to look at sky at radio wavelengths, we need to use some special techniques because sky at our wavelengths is not visible to our eyes. Exact, the, the way we can look at moon or stars. So what we need to do is to collect signals from large number of dishes and combine them using power of supercomputing and then the whole process becomes exactly like the way our eye operates, the lens in our eye operates. So what we do at Ayuka is that we use some of the most sensitive telescopes in the world. For example, currently we are using Meerkat telescope in South Africa, that's currently the largest and most sensitive telescope and we are looking at signatures of cold gas in very distant galaxies and black holes in the sky. And last couple of years actually using this large project with the Meerkat telescope, we, that is me and students and postdoctoral fellows and our collaborators across the world, we have detected hundreds and thousands of new galaxies and black holes in the sky. And what we are planning to do now is to use this large sample of galaxies and black holes to understand how these objects are evolving as the universe evolves and also we are trying to see how gas in these galaxies or stars in these galaxies are actually affected by when this black hole in these galaxies become active. So this is the main problem that we are working at. But and as, at the same time, we are also working on a lot of techniques that how we can actually improve the imaging at radio wavelengths itself. And for this, we of course use uh, uh, some of the cutting edge technologies at IUCA.